David Mamet. He's got a feel for the way people talk and think and cheat and love. And he's got the Pulitzer Prize to prove it. Now America's most exciting writer makes his directorial debut. Join him in the house of game. Slowly look over my left shoulder and tell me if you see him. Yes, he's just crossing the street. The players. A sucker born every minute, huh? And two to take him. A woman of one world. You want to see how a true bad man plies his trade? Yes. Seduced by the thrill of another. We're about to sting this guy. I'll do it with you, please. Discovering that danger is the ultimate high. What is life without adventure? A man who offers you his trust. You've got to tell. A tell? You're telling me the hand that has the coin. You want to know a tell? His confidence. You watch this guy and tell me. Does he play with his gold ring? And takes you. Do you want to make love with me? For everything you've got. The game. In or out. Rule one. Don't volunteer anything. Secrecy. What are strange things seem? Keep your mouth shut. Rule two. What is it you think I want? Control. Somebody to possess you. To take you into a new thing. Rule three. I don't understand how this works. Deception. You keep looking for the tell. Rule four. Police, don't move. Survival. I've got to get out of here. Rule five. Ignore all other rules. We've lost $80,000 we borrowed from the mob. I should have turned around the first moment you brought the rug. In the house of games, there's no one you can trust. Who brought the damn cop? Not even yourself. <laughs> Lindsey Krauss, Joe Montaigne, in David Mamet's House of Games. that just recruited you. They called dumping me in the river and reshuffling my face recruitment? Yep, it works. <laughs> they took away his past. What the hell have you done to me? You did some work on you. Just your face. You were ugly. They gave him a new life. All I can promise you is tower for breakfast, pressure for lunch and aggravation for sleep. Are there any disadvantages? And a new name. Remo Williams. A lot of thought went into it. They turned him over to an ancient master. I'll show you chop sake. Sorry, I'm gonna rot. You move like a baboon with two crumb feet. A teacher who would show him how to live. We must sweat the poison from your body and rebuild from the inside. You always talk like a Chinese sports group. What to fear? Fear is nothing more than a feeling. Fear can never kill you. Jesus, this is no time for prayer. And when to kill? Your mind and your body become your weapon. He is being trained for a special mission. When will we be ready? Fifteen years. Fifteen years? <laughs> you have no sense of humor. His enemy is evil and powerful. Let's give him a body. See who claims it. But Remo is unarmed and dangerous. They're going to be the 11th commandment. Thou shalt not get away with it. that you specialize in out-of-print books. I require a book of love poems with spring coming. Yours, Dear Miss Hannah, we are sending by book post today a little book which I hope you will like. Yours faithfully, FPD, Marks & Co. You're curious about Frank, which you are. He's in his late 30s. Quite nice looking. Very nice, in fact. Cecily. Poor Frank. I give him such a hard time. What do you do with yourself all day? 
sit in the back of the store and read. I keep trying to puncture that proper British reserve. Imagine a whole country says Ross. <laughs> I'll probably walk in there one day without telling them who I am. Frank, he's still here. You're the only soul alive who understands me. Their love for words became a love for each other. 84 Charing Cross Road. Love, Frank. A true story based on a bestseller.